Some of these bones are fresh. Relatively speaking, of course. So uh, I started looking around for a rib cage, a spinal column, and uh, I looked in the bushes over here. I found something really cool. Check this out. Ah, yeah, and this is exactly how I found it. I didn't pick it up and put it back in the weeds. I spotted it, turned on the camera, and decided to make a video out of it. Sometimes coming out here, you know, you come across these cool random finds. I uh, picked some random game trail and I started wandering around through here, and and, uh, and I came across this pile of bones. But uh, this is really cool. I'm gonna I'm gonna display this one. Of course, I'm gonna hit it with a little bit of bleach when I get back, but. Uh, I don't know if that's the right thing to do. I'll do a little more research on it, but uh, yeah, this thing's gonna be cool. Yeah. All right. This one's got three here. It's got four here. I say, oh, you do some hunting this weekend? Yeah, I got a seven point. What the hell is your seven point? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but yeah, right on. It's got quite a bit of weight to it too. Man, that's a good find right there. All right, guys, let's see what else we can get into. All right. Struggling through these uh, vines here. Finding that deer skull didn't help me a whole lot because now I'm carrying the camera and I'm carrying a fishing pole and now I'm carrying a deer skull. So it's uh, actually really quite difficult to trudge through here. However, doing so has uh, opened up an opportunity to catch this guy. And it being really cold, it being really, really cold, uh, they're slow. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to get this get this uh, garter snake. All right, check this out. cold and you're gonna be stressed out. I won't hold on to you long. So just do some videos. Right, there you go. Oh, got musk all over me. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna, yeah. He's got stink. <laughs> Look at there. Easy now. Here's a cute little garter snake. All right, relax. Okay, I'm gonna let him go. <laughs> yeah, it's not too bad. Usually those uh, guys, when they musk you, ooh, boy, get all stinky like that. <laughs> My cat, he hates it. As soon as he smells it, he runs off. But uh, but yeah, that's pretty cool. What are you still still doing here, man? Run off. He's hanging out right here. <laughs> Here, check this out.
yeah, it's pretty cool. I'm not gonna mess with them anymore. It stresses them out. And they uh, have a, a lactic acid buildup and and uh, it causes problems with their muscles and things. So, um, so I'm just not gonna mess with them anymore. I mean, just holding on to them like that in these temperatures isn't really even a good idea. So I'm just gonna let them relax, and keep quiet. Still though, like I was saying before, it's it's pretty neat, you know, to you know come across that guy because I got all tangled up in some greenbrier vines and and uh, and that's when I noticed him. I wouldn't have seen him if he didn't move. He moved just a little bit. And I spotted him. I was like, oh, cool. So, but uh, yeah, here it is. Uh, you know, early January. It's been freezing cold out. So this guy, he's trying to get as much sun as he can. You know, warming up. But uh, these temperatures, we did have uh, below freezing temperatures the other night. Uh, right now it's only in the mid 50s. So it's not so bad. I mean, I'm in short sleeves right now. So I had a scarf on earlier. I had to take that off so I didn't, didn't get tangled up trying to catch this snake. But uh, they're easy little guys. All right, cool. Well, anyway, let's carry on and uh, see what else we can get into. Hopefully, uh, Hopefully I'll find a couple more of these guys. Hey everybody direct your attention to my Patreon account. With your donation through Patreon, you help support Jungle J Adventures provide better content in more exotic locations. So go on over and check it out. Donate $5 today, and I'll send you a cool Jungle J logo or a Monster Skeeter decal free. And like always, thanks for watching. Take care.